Hey there guys. So today guys, I want to talk about protecting the floor mats. Not that many products out there on the market. I want to visually improve it because they slightly are faded away to what they used to look like. And I found a really nice, interesting product. This is Meguiar's interior detailer that cleans and protects all interior surfaces. Well, creates a durable sand finish. So I'm just gonna show you guys how I'm gonna use it. So what I got here, is a microfiber cloth. Now I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna apply the product, shake it up really well. I'm gonna apply it all over the, this a bit too much, but you really have to work it in. And as you can see, immediately, it starts doing its job. And they say, it's a cleaner well it kind of is but i think it's more of a dressing to me than, the, than it is a cleaner sorry folks working with one hand here and it says you can apply it on steering wheels which i thought immediately if i can apply it on steering wheel i can apply it on car mats i wouldn't apply it on car pedals though what the instructions say if you take a terry cloth and buff it out, you, you kind of need to buff it out and it will leave like a more glossy finish. And if you take a microfiber cloth, it will leave, leave a lat, matte finish. Some places it's a bit too glossy for me. So what I tend to do is guys, I take another microfiber cloth. Um, that is, I'm just gonna damp it a little bit with my interior APC. That's a bit too much. And what I'm gonna do next, is I'm gonna tone it down a little bit with that APC just lightly. I don't want a heavy APC on it. What I'm gonna do is just slightly tone that product down. I don't want it completely gone. But just gonna tone it down. I'm left with a dressed car floor mat. It's really, it's not greasy. It kind of has this math look. It just looks like the way, it looks like the day when I got these floor mats for this car. And eventually I think it will tone down even more. It will turn even more matte. But so far, it's a good product to use on car mats from where I'm, I'm concerned. It's safe because it's a, it leaves like a matte surface. It's not greasy, so you, especially when, on the driver side, which I applied it also. It's not gonna slide um, when you get out of the car. You don't wanna fall. I apply it on the steering wheel as well and I use the same technique. I tone it down a little bit. I prefer my steering wheel really, really matte because it's like a new new kind of look to it. When your car steering wheel is matte, it's kind of, it looks brand new. But um, yeah, I degreased the wheel before that. So as far as I'm concerned for floor mats, it's a good product. Upper panels, it's fine. It's good for plastic like this. For leather, uh, I don't really know. You have to really try it out. On glossy finishes like this, it's okay. But the only problem is you need to tone it down all the time. So it's relatively cheap. You get for like less than 10 pounds now in Halfords. Great on floor mats. I don't know a lot of products that will kind of you apply that you can apply, kind of renew the floor mats a little bit, and then you know leave like a satin finish, non-greasy satin finish. But that's what I would probably use it for and they're gonna last me for ages. So thank you for watching the video guys. Like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next videos.